right down, we'll zone you. I forgot that, like, pockets... No, wait. You did not. No, no. So this, this, this loops and, and grinds the all over itself. We, we went to the door that we couldn't open. So hit, then... hit your map and we'll see if we've actually been here. But I don't see any cath hat. Yeah, see? The all... other end of the same yeah. map. Okay, that's what it is. Uh, and that's leading to the southern path. Yeah, there's shit all over the place. The north path. Okay, cool. So let's just connect those dots over here. Delicious, delicious dots. Oh, where's this going? To the southern path. Oh, just to the grove again. Which is where we were. Okay. Oh, oh more Mandalorians! Almost. Oh. What? Okay, you talk- yeah. Out of this again. If you haven't given us enough money, I guess we're gonna have to take it out of you piece by piece. No, please! Take my wife and children instead. Anything. Wow. Jeez. <laughs> uh, Don't feel bad about that. Not really. Good idea. Yeah, no. Off you go. All right, how about this, though? Let's see what happens. The brave Jedi. Who, oh no. He's immune to something. Oh, hit, hit, uh, cancel all that shit. Yeah. And hit burst of speed. Because it'll give you, like, more, uh, attack bonuses. There you go. Okay, um... Yeah, there you go. You already have queued up four actions. Yeah, yeah. Fuck. Alright, well that immune ain't so immune after, uh, after all, so they're fine. They're good. They're good. Oh no. Save. You did it. Oh, and now you can steal all their horrible shit. Yeah. And, uh, well, maybe drop back to the base for Equipment pack. What a piece of shit. Another Mandora pad. Fucking nailed it. Recent. Oh, Jedi Rope! Yes! It's in your inventory. Yes. That's Jar what they gave me for completing the quest. Ah, Jarg, do you not remember to take that shit out today? Something funny about one of the intakes. Consider yourself lucky. If somebody was dumb enough to take that thing out, he would have plowed right into the ground within a kilometer. Amazing how they use centimeters and kilometers out here in space. Yeah, it's crazy. It's, it's almost like it's the right thing to do. It's almost like it's the right, the moral thing to do. So it does give you defense bonus, but not much. Slightly. Yeah. But... Hey, That's hey, what it's actually hey, about, hey. right there. I feel like super serious, cool guy, like Obi Wan. He's he's the not shittest Jedi. How about that? Yeah. Okay. I'll take that. Yeah. I'll take that. And Ewan McGregor is like, yo, he's so not shit. I'll do it again. Oh, why'd I do it again? <laughs> oh, why'd I do it again? Again. Um, oh, I'm fucking locked in, aren't I? He might be, but he said no one's talked to him, but he said he'd do it again. If I was you and McGregor, I would be desperate to do it again. <laughs> desperate. Now that it's back and now that it's back in decent hands. Well, yeah. to, uh, having even if it was shit, it's going to be better than the old crap. I could not imagine how stoked you I imagine you and McGregor was when he got that fucking phone call to disassociate with what, with what he was. No, I mean way back in the day. Oh, hey, yeah, you want to yeah. be Obi Wan Kenobi? Oh yeah. Which oh is, yeah. Yeah, no, again, which, <laughs> which is why you can't blame like Sam Jackson or N Sync for being like trying to, for trying to get in there. You know? You can't stop me. Oh no. Natalie Portman, do you want to be this generation's Princess Leia? Who the fuck doesn't? Oh, no! <laughs> I'm in the most universally reviled love plot since... Yeah, I didn't think that would happen. Um, I'd say Twilight, but that's no, future that's your times. This is private property. By what authority? Oh, wait, what was she in? That horrible movie with the manic pixie dream girl? That fucking thing that all those fucking hipster dirtbags love. Garden State. Garden State, that's it. 
the movie I own on DVD and the and soundtrack Blu-ray. I proudly listen to. Yeah. What, do you listen to it on your hamburger phone vi- vinyl maker? Hey, man. Hey? They, they played Fru Fru, and he ran away back to her instead of getting on the plane. And that was the shit. <sighs> Fuck you. <sighs> my weapons are my authority. I want oh, no, wait, I can actually try to do this by talk talking. Yeah. Or you can just leave. From the Jedi Council. Master Matali wishes to speak with you. I will inform him that you are here. Remain at this location until he arrives. How about no? That voice sounds really familiar to me. I think it's Simon Templeman. Who that? He's a uh, Kane. Of Legacy of Kane. Oh, I see Pock's kind of walking My into that shit. My droid tells me you are here on behalf of the Council. I was beginning to think my demands had been ignored. You burst in. So I think your time would be better spent interrogating the Sandals as to the whereabouts of my son Shen. Um. Yeah. Any info? What do you got? I have already told my story to the Council. Why did they not inform you of my circumstances? That's actually a really good question. I did not expect such incompetence from the Jedi, but I shall repeat the tale once more. Many years ago, I brought my family here to Dantooine to escape the crush of humanity on the core worlds. Soon after we settled here, the Sandrals arrived, and they have been a plague upon my house ever since. The injustices the Sandrals have committed against the Matales are far too numerous to name. But the Council Good old is well aware space of our many feud, disputes. Yeah. Recently, I discovered several Sandral houses and trespassing on my land. What were they doing? I had no doing? idea what nefarious purpose lay behind their arrival. My own assassination, perhaps. That's a bit destruction of my property. Presumptuous. Hey, let me tell you what's going on. Your son Shen is hooking up with the out. others willingly. My own security droids destroyed the invaders. Not a single one survived. Because you're well, such an asshole. <laughs> it was shortly after this incident that Shen. You're such an asshole that he's like, I want nothing to do with you. Fuck well, I can't believe you spoiled yourself on the Kotor plate. I can't believe you went and played ahead and watched all the cutscenes. It's out of control. Why are you jumping to conclusions? Why does the council insist on stalling? The life of my son is at stake. Is it possible? Yes. Of and course. here we go. Here we go. You ready? Now I understand. I am a man of the world, Jedi. I know how things are done. I will make a contribution of a thousand credits. I wasn't to the even going there, but fine now. Okay. From the sandals. My pockets are deep enough, motherfucker. You, of course. Fill them up. Whether the council ever learns of this donation is completely up to you. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Too yeah. Too yeah. Too your greed is outstripped only by your utter lack of any sense of proportion, Jedi. Two thousand. Even if you would pay such a fee, what could you possibly need so many credits for? Have you but seen the armor like costs on this fucking planet? It's crazy. The Central Estate. Two thousand is out of the question. Nevertheless, my offer still stands. A thousand credits for Shen's safe return. Oh, he return. just said no. Oh yeah. Know, however, that I will not sit idly All right. by much longer. So Eventually, off. I will take whatever action is necessary to rescue my son, including raising the entire Sandral estate. Until you Isn't find that like Shen a big Jedi, crime? We huge, have nothing huge further crime. To discuss. He seems to only have droids in his army, though. To their estate, lest I take matters into my own hands. Big threats from big boys. Oh man, you got big dark side for being a jerk ass there. Hey, I was being practical. How can I help? Tell me about it was the dream. less of a dream and more of a vision, a vision the two of us shared. But I am certainly willing Girl, to Girl, I saw you in my dreams, and the dream was horrible and had portents of a dark future. I guess it's not as romantic when I say it like that. Uh, I still don't understand why they came to this planet. Why did we dream about them? Perhaps because we desired to. Perhaps because they came to this planet and were strong enough in the Force to leave a, a trace. What do you mean? They did something important here. Of that, I am certain. It may be simply that we are sensitive to that event, or it may not. We dreamed about Revan and Malak either because we were meant to or because we needed oh, to. Oh, that is so frustrating. There is no other way to look at it. You might as well wave your hands around in the air while you're saying 
Not sure I like the idea of you being in my dreams. That's pretty good. Oh, man. Uh... What are they doing? No idea. It was obviously important, however. That is why we must Clearly you won't have further. answers for me, because it's too early in the game. It's much too early. Alright, well, that's fine. Well, we have more. We will. I would rather not rely Guess on such what, visions Wally? to guide us. But you we will. Have so little else to go on, and the galaxy hangs in the balance. The whole galaxy? As you wish. You really should return our thoughts to business anyway. It's a door. Yeah. You are not allowed. This is private property. Leave him So yeah, you talk to him and the fucker comes out. Yeah. This is a big ass, big, big, big. Big grabs, big, big. It's almost as if you can, like, do other things. Almost. Yeah, you're not allowed. To the Sandrals! Yeah. What about over here, though? Oh, it's just oh man, I thought that said horny calf hound. Oh, no. Force slow, force slow. Now for burst of speed. Hey, wow! Everybody gets one. Pockets! You're so strong! Hold me like spider- what? <laughs> right, you got night speed, that's good. What else you got available to you? Well, I want night speed, but... I mean, yeah, but I mean, I mean, is there any other level twos you might want before that? Okay, you got affliction, that's good. Affliction was poison? It becomes slow. You got shock number two. Mm -hmm. Still haven't gotten to use that actually. I know yeah. I can. Yeah. All right, speed, speed, speed. All right, what does that do? Duration, movement, speed is doubled. Defense is increased by four, and one attack per round is gained. Now flurry will hit four times. Fair. Pockets, how many times can you swing that fucking lightsaber? How much time you got? got quite a bit of time, honestly. Might as well jump on Yeah, back. why not? Good job, everybody. And off you go. Ooh. This is the rest of the open field. I believe so. If you check your map, you'll be able to see yeah. it. We're connecting both halves. Yeah, the only thing you didn't see is the bottom of the Sandral. Uh, it might It might have uh, It might have nothing. It might have ten things. We'll never know. I really hate that the burst of speed makes the uh, game look like dog shit. <laughs> it's pretty annoying, but I feel like it's the only way they could have handled whatever, like, draw distance issues they probably would. Yeah, just blur it up. It probably takes more processing power, though. Yeah, you did it. All right. Pass south, I suppose. Yeah, that's where we did it. On either work. one. Fine. You still got some Mandos to murder. And I still have some powers to test. Hey, you gotta use that shock More shit. More importantly. See what that shit's about. Do we have any Kinrath babies you can shock horribly? Ooh. I mean... It's I kind just, of a waste, because they don't have the HP to withstand it, but at the same time, you get a satisfying little, like, popcorn pop. Oh, delicious. Turn into a little thing. Did that recover by the time the power... Yes. Hit, like, you got it's used? It's free. Okay. It's completely free. Good to know. To the Grove! Man, this is so improved by these much faster load times. Uh-oh! Well, I gotta get in there first. Yeah. Let's get in there. Blam! Yeah, shock him. I think you got interrupted. Oh, shock doesn't hit the wave currently. It's just... It only hits the one. Yeah, okay. And it used a whole lot of power. Yeah, it did. Uh, put a top off in a second. What I ended up using it on uh, is like once you get to the third level and it's like a, a code attack. Mm -hmm. uh, it's just like, are there five guys in front of me? Pop. That's level three? Yeah, I believe so. It might be level two. It's been many times. I love that you're now doing flurries on by, by on the regular. Just one extra attack, why not? 
So. All right, that's another pass south to the to the that shit, and then there's a big middle area that you never once saw. That might have dirty mandos in it. Dirty, dirty loot. Oh, by the way, now that you have Bastila, if you switch to Bastila, you'll be able to yeah. use heal. Yes. Right. She had that going on. She did. Yep. Um. Yeah. Cure him. Oh no, that's for everybody. W which heal are you thinking of? The heal you just used. Yeah. It's just AOE. It's the group. It's the group. Yes, yeah, right. the group. Yep. Yeah. True. I'm true. Here. True. I forgot. It's been a minute. Hey, who the fuck are you? But why? You a merchant? What you want? He's a Jedi from the Enclave. I was sent by the Jedi Council to investigate a killing that took place a few hours ago. That was like... I was like, yeah. Wasn't me! Totally. Whole lot of killing going on, but... Wouldn't be. Okay, so everybody here speaks basic, so it's not gonna be a problem. All right, I've been ha I'd handle it myself, but I figured it'd be a, tra a good training exercise for you to solve this murder. Every lazy Jedi can just pass the buck off on this one. It's training. Uh, my it's dishes need cleaning. Use the opportunity to learn something about cleansing filth, Jedi. Perhaps you could figure out the truth from the lies. <sighs> what? Oh, did you see Pox's fucking face? I didn't get the close-up. Oh, man. Dark side's starting to affect you considerably. What? What are you talking about? It's bad morning. Got some crust in my eyes, that's all. And no, uh, forehead and side head. All right, solve the problem yourself. We already practically figured it out, but... But you solve it. I just want to see if you can do it. Uh-huh. Look at all the evidence and the droid and gather the evidence and then talk to me about it. Oh my god. And then I'll take credit. Are we yelling, Yeah, a little bit. If you can't figure it out, I'll just deal with it myself. But then I'll make fun of you. And Vrook is gonna be like, oh, what a dumbass. His little fucking Yoda voice. I can't believe they can just fucking pass. Alright, here's the accounts. Three men in the field before the clouds broke. Alright. Are we gonna have to rash them on this, this fucking story together? It was weird, because you'd think they'd go inside if it was dark. But whatever, that's not important. This dead guy got shot in the back. Rifle was found in his body with blood. We're looking for the bloodstains now. Mm -hmm. Damn, that's corpse. The two other guys were found. One's Han and Ghoul. He didn't have nothing. The other was Rickard Luzov, who's carrying a hunting laser. Okay. Dick. Both men said they didn't do any, and they just found him. But then they also say the other guy did it. Okay, and does one always tell the truth, and does one always lie? Look, look at her fucking face! When I arrived, Handon was holding his side, and Rickard was favoring a leg. Try and remember that as we go forward. Rickard was favoring a leg. Okay. So Handon had a hand on his side. Damn it. And Rickon Boo. Did a kickin. Boo. Oh, I couldn't be booing with my soul any harder. Alright, let's talk to this chump. Hey, Rickard. Hey, Rickard the kickin. Another Jedi, huh? Helping that Twi'lek investigate, no doubt. He seems stumped. I'm Rickard Lusoff. Maybe you can figure this out and let me get out of here. Lahop. Oof. Yeah, now you see it. <laughs> Oof. Well, I was out hunting Eriaz when I spotted one over here by the bridge. I pull out my rifle and aim at it. I couldn't see it that well, mind you, because the damn sun was in my eyes. So I shoot it and it drops. I walk over here and find Handon standing over Calder's body. So why don't you get this whole farce over with and send that whiner Handon to the prison he belongs in? All right, that's one account. So the clouds didn't break, or they did, and then you couldn't see any shot, and then you walked over where he was standing. Over. Yeah, seems pretty simple. What up, Halden? You shot Handon. a dude. You shot a dude, oh, and the other guy was like, "What happened?" You must be assisting Master Baluk in his investigation. I'm Handon Gould. 
Perhaps you've heard of me? <laughs> uh, sure. Yes, uh, I yeah. have, of course, Mr. Gould. Mm. Well, uh, then I assure you, on my reputation, I had nothing to do with the killing. That I automatically makes me think he's guilty. Can, you see, I was out here running earlier today. Yes, running. I do that a lot. Can't stand speeders, never use them. Keeps me in shape, too, you know. Anyway, I was out running on the other side of that bridge there, and all of a sudden I heard a shot coming from over here. I ran over and found this man Calder lying on the ground, dead. Go on. And I saw Rickard come skulking out of the shadows of the rocks south of the river, and I knew something was wrong. I hit my emergency button and called the Enclave right away. Well, there. That's my story. Now, please hurry this up and arrest Rickard so I can get on with my day. Do you have any uh, ability to examine the body or anything? That's what I was about to go figure out. There, there he is. He was shot from behind with a blaster. And you can talk to the droid for uh, more details. Greetings, Padawan. You must be the one Master Baluk has enlisted to help him with this problem. I am an information retrieval droid. All the droids have incredibly low voices for some reason. Mm -hmm. The Jedi and Kevin from the central government facilities here in Dantooine. If you have any need of my services, please do not Tell me who did it. I have already retrieved some information from the archives on Paul the Metic, Ricard Lusoff, All right. and Handan Gould. I have also had time to examine the body of Mr. Nettick. Is there any information you require? Did anyone wipe your shit? What'd you find? My preliminary analysis of the body indicates that he was killed approximately three hours ago by a single energy blast. Okay, this is actually some dang and romper shit. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, tell me about the, the area. These planes are rife with wild animals, not all of them benign. The Iriars are mostly docile, but can easily be provoked to violence. Cathounds, on the other hand, are much more. Yeah, we've been seeing a bunch of those. There have been over 35 catalog attacks on settlers by cathounds in the last two weeks. A general advisory was given out three days ago to carry a weapon at all times when on the planes. Small farms and holdings dock the planes and can provide safe refuge for those in need. Is there any other information you need? Um, that's all you got? That's all? I will be here to assist you. I believe you can go back to the guys and then follow up. How can I be of further assistance? Hold in your side. You injured? In injured? No, of course not. Why would I have been? Fit as a bantha. <laughs> I run. I don't know if I mentioned that. That's How can it. I be of further assistance? Why were you here? I was taking my daily constitutional. I just happened to be running by when I heard a shot. I ran over and found Calder's body lying there. Do you often run here? Yes, quite often. I generally prefer running to anything else. Can't stand speeders. A healthy body will breed a healthy mind, as I always say. <laughs> okay. That's it. Of for course. now. Of course. Listen, if you need anything, I shall be glad to assist. All right, let's talk to the other guys, see if we can fucking figure so, this out. What do you want to know? Said you were limping. What up? Well, I kind of sprained my ankle running through the bush before I found the body, but it's nothing that serious. So, what do you want to know? I told you already, didn't I? Was hunting some eerie ass. Haven't seen many in the area recently, but with those cat hounds acting up. But they're still around. Was in my blind a little south of here when I spotted one, like I said before. I shot, and pow, went down. But when I come over here, there's Handed standing over the body and the eerie ass was gone. Now, I don't have nothing to do with this, so can I go now? Not just yet. Ah. So, what do you want to know? I believe... Right. Okay. That so might be it. We we'll take it back to Buluk. Yeah, Buluk. Uh, yeah, what do you got? Oh, what do you got? the work for me? I want to discuss the murder. Mm -hmm. Alright, sure. Let's put it together as yes. it happens. Hannon said he was nearby and heard a shot and ran over, only find Calder already dead. Sid Rickard came out of the shadow of, his, of the rocks holding a blaster in his hand. Mm -hmm. said he was hunting areas, saw one through the glare of the sun, and shot at it. Mm -hmm. It's possible that Rickard might have shot Calder accidentally, and Hannon may have found the body, but that seems very unlikely. It seems that more likely that at least one of them is lying. 
Jumalita kutotun. Chilamulane ni mucheshak pa. Obviously, one of these guys is full of shit. Which one? Well, now I know when I run. Oh, I love. I look over and I just see the controller go down and really stretch out. Now I know that when I go running, my ribs can hurt sometimes. Because mm -hmm. that's what happens when you're out of shape. Yeah. So you can get hurt in the ribs when you run. Mm -hmm. So you can be favoring your side. Mm -hmm. But kicking is like, what, what happened to your foot? What's that about? Mm -hmm. um, unless you kicked him in the side, and then who knows? But um, uh, I, I mean, I, 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 the whole like running over, finding the body thing. Like the fact that he couldn't see too well. He says unlikely. It's that that's what happened. It seems one of them's lying, but. What is this Uriaz? Where is the Uriaz's body? Uriaz? So I, t I totally remember the solution to this. So I'm on standby. I, I, sure. I'm just wanting to see you work through this. No, I mean, I, I get that the game is trying to sway, like, sway me away from what seems to be the obvious based on their explanations. Mm -hmm. But it's like, I shot this monster and now it's gone. What? Like, that doesn't make much sense to mm -hmm. me. So, um... I, I, I think that record is lying. Mm -hmm. oh, but why do you think that? Hmm. What is the nature of a man, you ask? Mm -hmm. There's no area for him to hide here. It was cloudy, and uh, there was no sun glare. He was mean. That's true. There was no sun glare if it was cloudy. Okay, so reconsider, and let's see what the other choices are. Mm -hmm. I don't want. I don't want to press A. Just yeah, I know. One of these men is not telling us, but where does the truth lie? Okay, so let's say Handing's lying. Mm -hmm. But why do I believe that? <laughs> I fucking hate the. Yeah, I know. It's only with the aliens. Fat people always <laughs> lie. He mentioned. He didn't mention the weapon found by the body. He's here at just the right time. Actually, I reconsidered. That's true. He did not mention the weapon found by the body, but I think the cloud breaking is a more yeah. uh, damning piece of evidence. And let's back all the way out. Not the much Uh, yeah. That's go. that's conclusive. So yeah, I don't, I don't know. know. Let's see if they have another round of things that we can. Uh, oh, really? We can examine. Yeah. Okay. I remember the answer, but I don't remember. Examine the stories more closely. Speak with the information retrieval droid and data. Okay, so now I have those those big things to go. All right, fine. Let's get a third round going. What did you see happen? Hunting Iriaz, Hunting Iriaz over by the bridge. The sun was pretty much right behind it. So I didn't see too it. That's not true. There was clouds in the sky. I shot, and when I came over here, it was crazy. He might have taken my Iriaz. There wasn't an Iriaz in sight. I think he might have taken. Calder okay. must have been hunting it himself, because there was a rifle lying close to the body. Bullock's got that now. Mine, too. I want that back. Oh, that was a new one. That was a new one. Yeah. So, what do you... Uh, what if I keep going here? Well, I was out hunting Eerie as South... I okay, that was the same one. Calder must have been... Okay. Right. And then you... Yeah, what do you got? Further assistance. What'd you see again? I will. Actually, I, I didn't see anything. I was over across the bridge. I heard a shot and came over. I can tell you I was sure surprised to see Calder's body lying there. I just got here when I saw Rickard coming out of the rocks holding his blaster. I was terrified. I had no idea what he was going to do, so I hit my emergency button and called the Enclave. Master Baloot came out here with his droid and started questioning us. I, I think he really doesn't understand what's going on. I hope that you'll be able to make a more informed decision and get me out of here soon. I have things I have to do. Yeah, he's not mentioning, like, the blaster or any of that stuff. That is true. But I still can't... But that's, like, the absence of evidence is not... Not the evidence of that. As you know. Of course. Of course. Listen, if you need anything, I shall be glad to assist.